I've been drilling on this property for about 23 years. I started here in 1989 and it had just been bought from Western States, I think in 87. That was the start of uh, Barrick. And uh, since we've mined 30 to 40 million ounces out of the ground. We bought this ER560 in January of this year. We bought it to do uh, in-pit RC drilling. We still plan on using it for that. But right now we're mining through some voids, so we're using it to map our voids, make sure we know where they're at before we mine through. We know this the void is fairly deep, but as far as the width, that's kind of what we're concerned about for obviously our, our trucks and all our support equipment. We have an ore body that's sporadic. It comes and goes, so we use the RC option for finding our ore ahead of time. The DEI that it has in there, the dr drill efficiency indicator, it lets you know how deep you are, how, what your penetration rate is, and it's nice uh, to use it on the, the voids because we can actually pinpoint where we're going to hit that void and uh, how far and how wide it is. As far as the cabin part of the, the machine, there's not a whole lot of steps you've got to crawl up. It's just one little step and then you're in and the controls, they're easy, great handles to, to operate. The screens for the computer in there are you know, right there. It's got a nice fuel tank. You can run all day on the tank of fuel, plus a little longer if you have to. As far as checking oils, all your other good stuff that you gotta do, it's really simple. It's right there, it's right to the point. Easy to run. It's the steepest learning curve of any drill I've ever worked on. But once got over that learning curve, it's simple and fast. Any old school veteran driller could run this drill. You can get it in tight spots, you can just do a whole lot of things with this drill. We have had no problems with this drill. It's been constantly running.